Okay, guys, what's up? It's T3 Gaming. Oh, it's gotta be. What time is it? Uh, it's 3:12 in the morning. You got me slaving over here. Uh, I mean, I know it's not a big deal. Big whoop, 20 20 upvotes on a on a video, but you know it's hard to get exposure sometimes. The kill with Jinichiro, if that's how you say his his Japanese name. Um, yeah, so. I think we're in the clear. That was. That was, I blame you. I, I blame you. Oh, shit. Okay, so. You are basically like spamming A to get through the cutscene at this point, and you just want to get it done. So, I plan to be a little more aggressive this time, and I really focused on, you know, my perfect parries. As you can see, early on, I'm getting, you know, a good six, seven in a row there. I'm still gonna dodge that because, in my opinion, it's very easy to dodge. You know exactly what direction it is because he telegraphs it. It's been a while since I've fought him, but I'll try to remember as I go here. This is uh, Ham Mitch, by the way, from the Reddit. I don't know really how Reddit works. I'm getting better at it, but still don't know what's acceptable and what's not, you know, so. Uh, so as you can see, continuing to get a lot of perfect parries. And it's, and I didn't script anything in the last video. That's one thing I'm never going to do is script shit, because I know a lot of YouTubers do that. But yeah, I mean, it's just one of those things where I was like, all right, if I don't do it right now, I might, I might give up for the first time in my gaming life I might actually give up at a video game and I've never done that that goes way back to uh, Zelda 2 uh, what are some of the hard games uh, you know let's see I'm not trying to brag or anything I'm just sort of letting you know like what it compared to uh, Bloodborne Platinum Dark Souls 2 all DLC Platinum um, Dark Souls 3 89% uh, and uh, Dark Souls 1 I actually didn't like when I first played it and I decided to go back and try Dark Souls 2 and that hooked me in actually Bloodborne was the first from software game I played then I when the remastered version of Dark Souls 2 came out I got that and ever since then whatever they bring out I'm buying but yeah so I was having a lot of trouble with the charged bow shot this shot right here once I got that timing down because it, it's actually pretty easy to dodge it. I'm not sure what everybody else is doing because I don't really watch a lot of like Sekiro videos, but it's very easy once you have the timing to just dodge out of the way, you know? Right there, I probably shouldn't have did that, but I did. I mean, once you fight him so many times, it gets to a point where, okay, even if he tries to shoot me right in the face from five feet away, I'm gonna, I'm gonna perfect on it. got me there. I tried to dodge there. That move looked a lot more dangerous than it actually was. I think it gave me some problems early on, but we learned that one pretty quick. But more than anything, it was the bow, I think, that caused me the most problems. And a lot of times I would get screwed right there. So I was sort of paranoid about my posture. Trying to let off the button, regain my posture back. But I was always paranoid about it, always looking at it, like, in the corner of my eye. Or the bottom of my eye, I guess you could say. <laughs> yeah, I have this, like, 50-inch Samsung over here that I'm sitting way too close. I'm, like, four feet away from it. Bad spot. I'm probably burning my retinas out. Yeah, so it's been so long, I didn't realize that it actually takes a lot more good deflect. Some, sometimes I get a little lazy and I'll spam deflect, which is no good, obviously.
Uh, bow. So, I get to this point, I'm like, alright. I got it. I know what's going on. I'm confident that I'm not going to jump too early. Or I won't find myself in the air during a lightning. And I went ahead and started off with that counter there. I wasn't even sure you could do that, <laughs> by the way. Because, I, like I said, I don't like to look stuff up and I don't like to spoil stuff. So I was like, I bet that's considered a lunge. So I tried it and it worked. That was pretty cool. That time I was a little too afraid to do it. <laughs> I get a little wild here. Right there. Didn't do it again. I Actually, less Hikiri. Oh, how do you even say that? Hikiri counter? That's the first lightning bolt, I think, that hadn't hit me in 56 attempts. Straight. That's the first time I didn't get hit by it or dodge it or whatever. That was real bad right there. You gotta be something wrong for that to hit you. I don't know what happened there. I'm pretty sure I pressed the button, but I guess I didn't. That, I got pretty damn lucky. Oh, there we go. I got pretty damn lucky on that. But, I mean, I obviously would have been able to get up, but... I had him right there, dead to rights. And that's just, you know, that's normally where you're going to get. Over here at T3 Gaming, we don't mess around. Uh, we talk our way through situations, and we let people know, like, you know, how it really is in life. Um, I can be a mentor, I can be a, a friend, and I can also be, uh, you know, I could I, down and dirty if I have to, as far as, like, you know, giving someone lip or letting someone know they're out of place. Um... You guys, I expect the same from you. So hit me up, you know. This is one it's all about community. It's all about being there. I plan on making a Discord here soon. So it is it's been a journey, but I'm starting to get more confident about YouTube and I'm starting to get more confident about, you know, what what lies ahead, you know. This is not even really a video f to show off that I killed the guy. Everybody's killed him, but I'm just trying to let you know, guys know a little bit more about who I am personality-wise. All right, I appreciate it. Y'all have a good one. Do whatever they tell you to do at the end of videos. You know, how I, I don't like saying it. Uh, just do it, and uh, you guys take care. All right.